As he opens the door to the basement, a dark figure can be seen standing oh! the What do they do, baby? Back again with another reaction. Back with some more scary stuff, man. We got a whole bunch of scary videos. Let's see what the ghosts talking about today, man. Let's see what they. My know mom what posted saying? a photo from last year of her family celebrating on New Year's Day. Right. This is the photo of her family. Okay. There's nothing odd about this photo. Right. It's the second photo that contains something disturbing. What? Martha writes, It was only this year that we noticed an uninvited guest was celebrating with oh, us. Oh, where? Where? Who the f is that? Oh, they don't know who it is. I, that just look like a bad. That, that could be anything. They don't know who it is. Martha my thinks boy. that this might have been a family member who passed away. But others believe that this might have been a malicious entity, oh, no. as it looks very unwelcoming. No, Whether it's evil or not, it seems like it's having a great time. Spook hard, party. I'm not gonna lie, that looked like it could just be a photo in the background. I ain't a gonna photo hold. in the background? Yeah, like a, like a photo back there or something. Nah! That's not a ghost. I don't think that's a ghost. Be harder. <laughs> Josh Dean had set up a camera in his daughter's room and captured something that left him shook. Oh, this is the thing that Josh writes, oh, my I daughter was being one. pulled under the I bed. My wife thinks she crawled in, but she was clearly pulled by something. Uh, for reasons, we're going to skip this one, but yeah, it looked like she got pulled under the bed. It definitely looked like she got pulled under the bed. You know, it, it, go watch the video. It's li original link in the description. Hunter Emacs visits an abandoned hospital that is said to be one of the most haunted places in Japan. Woo! While taking a tour of one of the floors, this happens. Not a hospital. Not a hospital. He has a great voice for narration. Something in the ceiling? Did I miss it? I ain't seen nothing. Oh, wait, what? Whoa, whoa, whoa. A wheelchair rolls on its own. Oh. I can't help but think that this was the ghost of a patient trying to make its presence known. Oh, oh that oh, completely. Oh, it's completely gone. It completely. Mm. Oh, yeah, that one different. Oh, that's different. That's different, different. Yes, sir. No, Angelica sir. Angelica Hernandez writes, my nephew and the camera saw what we couldn't. Can you see it? I can't, it's too dark over there. I can't see it. Oh, it's a nigga in the kitchen. It's a nigga in the kitchen. Oh! It's a nigga in the kitchen. Oh, no, that nigga sitting the Indian style on plates. Oh! That nigga sitting the Indian style oh. on plates. Look at him! That nigga sitting in Indian style oh, on no. plates. Oh no, sir. And the and the kids saw it. Oh. Angelica adds that she had a clear view of the kitchen and window, but didn't see anything there, except for when she looked back at the video. Oh. As my with all goodness. videos, I don't claim any negative energy from this one. But you showing us he's these mugs. He's smart as hell. He's smart as hell. He's, he's, not, he's not saying he's he not, believe Yeah, not. okay. He's gonna okay. open that door and them niggas gonna be in his house. <laughs> Alyssa Dooley took photos of her son at an indoor playground, but didn't realize that she captured something creepy in the background. It was only after looking back at the photos that she noticed something strange. Okay. I took these pictures of my son yesterday, and whenever I got home, I reviewed all the, the pictures that I'd taken, and you see the little feet up at the top of each one of these pictures? Whoa. Whoa. They were not there whenever I took the photos, and my son was alone in that slide and no kid was up there with him. Oh no. Oh no, that's the live photos that exposed something, my boy. Ortega okay. Salas was hospitalized after having a heart attack. Okay. Ever since then, okay. things at home have been unusual. 
Ortega has been documenting all the strange things that have been happening, but it's the following video in which Ortega captures the most activity. While talking about these strange occurrences, this happens. Aquí unas cosas se han movido y tratamos de captar oh, lo más que bold. se pueda. Lo más que it's se pueda en bold. cuestionamiento de las cosas que se mueven. Tratando de... Mire, ahí está el primero. Oh, no, 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 ahí no, no. I can't, I can't, I can't do it. Not a dog, not yeah, a dog. No, no. Eso es lo not que me da. Oh, Eso es lo okay. que me da. Okay. Okay. No sé lo okay. que pasa. Okay. Tratando, Woo! tratando de este monito... Se lo dieron a mi esposa en, en, en el hospital. No sé si agarró no, un poco de, de, de cosa. Ese mono se nos ha caído ya varias veces hasta I la mean, noche. That's easy. The dog, has, the dog has a big head. He's just trying to denounce all that. I'm trying to like denounce all that. No sé talk. si realmente deba de agarrarlo. Pero tratando. Ese mono. Algunas cajas que tenemos aquí se nos han caído. Vamos a tratar de captar varias cosas para ver si alguien, alguien nos puede ayudar. Ahí vuelvo, es una vista panorámica para que vean que no hay nadie, no hay nadie, no hay nadie más que mi conejo me acompaña. A este cuarto, como les comento, es donde hay más actividad. Aquí quiero captar algo. No sé qué pase, que se pueda... Realizar es el juego de los salones, es el cuarto de los niños, pero de hecho tratamos de captar lo más que se pueda mover, pero al final ahí está el oh, no. no sé qué está pasando. Dios, tratando de decir pues, lo más que se pueda, lo más que se pueda captar. Como les digo, es el cuarto de los muchachos. Y oh, no. it's still going, it's still going. At this point, he better just be happy it ain't his room. <laughs> just be happy it ain't your room, The person was Mike. The fuck no kids was the person was Mike. I'm just saying. They can sleep in our room. Shit. Tratando de hacer Bro, that whole moving. That whole moving, moving. Él se empezó a mover muy leve. No sé qué pasa. The rabbit ain't nowhere to be found. Como pueden ver, aquí no hay nadie. Pueden ver. Absolutamente nadie. Panorámica. Ahí se movió el patín ya. Ah, no. Ahí está. Oh, 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 The most go. unsettling footage isn't this, though. We gotta go. In another video, Ortega captures something that caused him to run out of his room. Oh, no, shoot. No sé, tengo miedo. Oh, shoot. La verdad, tratando de lo que hiciera. Dios. Trataremos de hacer lo posible, ¿ok? Tengo miedo de hacer cosas. Damn, play with him. Oh, it's in his room, too. Dios santo. What are we looking at? What are we looking at? Nigga, what is that on his bed? Oh, no. Si tú eres la... Dios santo. Dios, Dios. Oh, it's not supposed to be there. Ortega believes that his near-death experience from the heart attack he had nah. might be the reason for all these strange occurrences. Nah, buddy. Whatever the reason might be, there is no reason for staying there any longer. Ha! 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 You think? Ha! Huh. You think? Ha! Huh, this, smart, this the smartest Got narrator it. I ever heard. Got it. He no. said no reason. Really, get no. out. No, sir. Bye-bye. Mm. Here's someone taking a bathroom selfie and capturing something unsettling. What is that behind her? What is, what is that? Oh, that's a head. That's a oh, that look like a whole. Oh, that looks like a whole Chucky doll. Oh, no. It seems like it was only after looking back at the ah. photos that she realized that her selfie wasn't actually a selfie. Another face appears on camera. Yeah. Nah. Talk about photo bombing. Nah, nah bro. Yeah, look. 
A clinic in Ecuador caught something oh. spooky on camera. Not Take a look. A, oh no. Y'all too calm. Y'all too calm. This nigga is taking a stroll in your presence. <laughs> that nigga like how did how did how did Oh no. Oh. Oh no. If only all poltergeist activity were like this. Man, fuck that. The fuck following that. video takes place at a cemetery, oh, he had a cemetery where a group of paranormal investigators encountered something beyond belief. These things gonna learn, bro. The Stay hard your way. ass out of there. They gonna learn the hard way. Stay. Oh, no. Hey, 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 this oh, cruising. No. It's cruising. cruising. Perusing the confines of the cemetery, nigga. And they go toward it. What's wrong with these people? Whoever was trying to raise the dad didn't really think this through because now they got to raise a child. They was trying to. Hey, that was good. That was a good little punchline you got there, my boy. I can't. I don't have the guts to do this, y'all. I don't. Like, I don't. Like, I don't. we in all the way believe that the cemetery we went to was haunted. It was just like a, it was like it might be type situation. It ended up being scary as hell. And it was scary. Pitch black out there. Like the dark camera like picked up way better than we thought it was because it, it was, was pitch black. Dark as dark as hell. <laughs> so I, I can't, I don't see how you can do this. Shit. And then Nick, Nick the living legend, this nigga gonna tell me that his house is full of haunted activity. And he used to it. That explains a lot. You are crazy, my guy. That explains That explains a whole lot. Oh my gosh. Top five ghosts. Caught on camera. When the walls come tumbling down. Right. Paranormal investigators Jordan and Johnny from the YouTube channel Paranormies are back on a new investigation ah. that brings them to an old abandoned train station in Piney, Manitoba, Canada. The Piney train station was closed in the 1960s. In the 1980s, a tormented local man named Dennis we didn't, we didn't see this one, have we? Mm. Okay, okay. strained like himself it. to death in the abandoned Piney train station. Go ahead and like it so we can know to never watch it again. Whoa. Locals believe that his spirit haunts the station to this day. People have seen unexplained shadows in the windows of- Why people don't ever burn down haunted places? That, that's a good question. Like, why, like, why don't you just burn it, bitch? Demolish it. Something. Like, what do you get from just letting that nigga roam? <laughs> like, <burn that> <laughs> down. The train station and curious explorers who dared to go inside would feel a presence watching them. The paranormies Jordan and Johnny set out to investigate whether the stories are true. Once inside the Piney train station, the two friends realize just how badly decayed the building is. The roof Damn. actually seems like it's about to collapse. Yeah. Yeah, that's that's yeah. that's breeding ground. Oh my God. That's breeding. That's breeding grounds. Is that upstairs? No, that's outside. Y'all don't even look prepared. That might be it, because look at the roof. Was that a piece of the house or was that you? Jordan and Johnny aren't sure whether they just captured something paranormal or something might have fallen from the ceiling. But the longer they're inside, the stranger the unexplained sounds become. No! They done pulled out a Ouija board. I'm like, I'm about to give you a hundred reasons why that's not a good idea. What? Reason number one. I'm gonna need you to read it out loud. Reason number one. Read that out loud. This is why we don't need to use a, a Ouija board. I gotta say that? Yes. Okay. Oh, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> we are black. Yes. Say it one more time. We are black. That's why we don't need to do no <laughs> shit like that. <laughs> Nigga, like, the fuck is you talking about? Like, what do you mean? Holy <laughs> Sound like glass shattering. 
This time the Paranormies team hears the sound of glass shattering somewhere inside the old train station. Jeez. But again, they can't quite place where the crash I'm came from. No but the next sound they hear is even creepier. She was saying he's so emotional. This doesn't even look like a train station. That's footsteps. Matter. That's footsteps. Cool. Hang on, hang on. Oh, no, buddy. This thing is going off right now. Dennis. Dennis. That's f loud, dude. I'm going up. Jordan and Johnny hear footsteps that coming from right above them on the second floor. However, when they go up to investigate, there's no one there. Of course! But the two explorers do find the source of one sound they hear. And it is absolutely terrifying. Oh no! With all the, like, the people that are coming through this place. React. What's that? React. How's that? What is that? Dude. What is it? Oh. What? Hang on. Is that, is oh! And it just stops. Oh, the lock on the door no. is eerily shaking back and forth on its own. When the investigators no, get close sir. to the door, the fast-paced rattling mysteriously just stops. Jordan and Johnny decide to do a okay, sensor. Okay, they, they already crazy for being in here. But the fact that y'all even trusted the building enough to go upstairs, that lets me know right there. You need psychological help. Y'all need, y'all need therapy or something. Bro, Pre deprivation serious. session. Jordan covers his eyes what and puts it? headphones in his ears so that the only thing he hears are the answers coming through their oh, spirit box. Fuck no. Meanwhile, Johnny asks questions to the spirit of Dennis that might be haunting the abandoned train station. They get some oh, strange answers, crazy. but then something even more shocking happens. Oh, oh shit. Here. Here. That was you. You're here. If you can make that noise again. I heard K2. If you can make that noise again, I'll check the K2. If you can make that noise again, let us know. In here. We'll come over there. No. In here. If you can make that noise again, I'll check the K2. If you can make that noise again, let us know. In here. We'll come over there. Sweep. What? There's a noise over there. Fuck. Oh my god. Did you see it? Oh! The bizarre silhouette of what looks like the upper half of a person can be seen slowly forming in the hallway. When Jordan shines his flashlight on the eerie figure, oh, it disappears. Oh Eventually, shit. the guys decide to set up a Ouija board to communicate with the spirit. Oh god! It did not go well. Of course not! Your hands and knees are just shaking. Did you move? It looks like it. it's crooked. Really? No, it's still over right over T. It's right over T, but I thought it was straighter before. Was that? The light just died? Or light just died. Was that you, Dennis? The thing was fully charged. Oh. Might be wow. using the energy. Oh, dude. Get out, get out, get out, get out. Get out, get out, get out. Thank you! Get out! Bow! Bow! Oh, and it's in the like middle of no! Holy oh, The light on their camera dies even though the battery is fully charged. And then the guys have to make a run for it as the station suddenly starts to fall apart all around them. They grab their camera, leave the Ouija board, and just get out of there. So did the paranormies capture supernatural evidence that proves that the- That's how you know I ain't never heard Nuke voice go get match the tempo of the action. Nigga. Nice. This is how you know this nigga was nice. it. And they go, da 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 train station <laughs> is haunted. <laughs> Did they capture the ghost of Dennis's lingering soul on camera? Or is it all just an elaborate hoax? As always, you decide. You can watch this full investigation and many more creepy videos over on the YouTube channel, Paranormies. Paranormies. Caught on camera. 
This next video was sent to me privately by Nuke's Top 5 viewer, Mary Therese Pagai from the Philippines. In her email, Mary says that she's a nursing student and that she was at home with her brother recording a demonstration video for her final exam. Then, this happened. One, three, go. One, okay na? Now that I have introduced myself to the patient, um, verify the client's... Now that I have introduced myself to the patient, explain the procedure and ask for his consent, verify the client's identity and provide... Okay, so far, Now that I have introduced myself to the patient, uh, now that I have introduced myself to the patient... <laughs> The light flickers for a second and then just off screen, the closet door forcefully slams open oh. on its own, scaring Mary and her brother so much oh. that they run from the room. In a follow-up video, Mary shows the closet that burst open and the story gets truly bizarre. Oh, no. So this is where it all began and this is the cabinet. And I'm actually very afraid to touch no, it or no, open it. I'm very no, sorry no, for no. the mess. So as you can see, this cabinet is full of clothes and no person can actually, oh my gosh, fit inside here. Oh. And this is where my brother stood. And this is the light switch. So my brother was um, videotaping me. Uh, filming filming here oh, i was standing here there, and my brother was standing here and there. the lights actually started to flicker before the cabinet opened and actually before that we were actually experiencing um weird things oh my gosh i'm very i'm sorry i'm very you scared but this is what it looks like inside. Tabi tabi po. Please, no person can actually it. fit inside here. It was actually me and my brother inside. I don't care if I would have been in that one too. Like you do with the shower curtain, yeah, yeah. boy. I would have been in that one. And That's right now, I'm not sleeping inside this room. I'm sleeping in my parents' uh, room. Smart. Girl. Mary explains that she is now Smart too scared girl. to sleep in her own room. And maybe she should be. Because during the recording of her follow-up video, a strange voice can be heard. Oh, yeah. And actually before that, we were actually experiencing um weird things. Yeah, we did hear it. We heard it. We heard it. Now, See? Mary has a YouTube channel, but her videos are entirely dedicated to her nursing education and have nothing at all to do with the paranormal. The Furthermore, part. Mary says that she's always been a skeptic, and before these videos, nothing paranormal had ever happened in her home. As for me, personally, I'd have to say that she genuinely looks terrified in this club. She genuinely was! What? What do you think? What remains? <laughs> like, what? Urban Explorer Christopher Hill from the YouTube channel Urbex Hill travels to the city of Warren, Ohio to explore the long abandoned St. Joseph Riverside Hospital. The sprawling medical facility was established in the 1960s. Everywhere. And as with any old hospital, thousands of patients passed away inside its walls. Many people believe that some of those patients never left. Because, you see, the St. Joseph Riverside Hospital is said to be extremely haunted. Chris enters the old decaying building, and as he explores the hospital's cluttered hallways and rotting rooms, he captures some very strange sounds. What? I would be in that Not at all. Ben. Back the ice up. Oh, get her loud. Which one? I don't know what I'm going Which one? You got like a lamb or a goat. So you, 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 you think a lamb or a goat going wrong its way on up in there? Like a raccoon or something. Yeah. Like a possum. It's yeah. just gone. 
Ah. It's, po- it's, a, it's possible. Upstairs. All, All right. Upstairs. All right. All right. <laughs> it's the <an> attic. <laughs> <All right. laughs> Later, and on a completely different floor, he hears this something. Got a lot of again. trust in that building. Ain't no lamb, my boy. Yeah, ain't no lamb, my boy. I thought I heard something. Now, I'm not sure exactly what these odd sounds could be. Obviously, it might be Damn. anything from animals inside the hospital to just some very odd building settling noises. Or possibly even something paranormal. But either way, Chris just shrugs it off and completes his exploration throughout the entire St. Joseph Hospital. But later on, oh. after Chris uploads his video, observant YouTube viewers oh, spot something that Chris oh, didn't even notice. Oh, Something oh, downright chilling. Oh, oh it's flooded. Did you see it? I did not. It's very easy to miss, but what appears to be a hand or arm can be seen oh! quickly disappearing behind the door frame. Chris has no, no idea what he's just captured and passes right by the door and continues right on to explore the flooded rooms down the hallway. Oh no, sir! So just what oh, is this? No, sir, that's... Could it simply be a squatter who is living in the old deserted building? Or oh, could it... I think that's a lamb. That's probably Mr. Tumpness. Chronicles of Narnia. He's like half lamb, half Okay, lamb. yeah, 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 yeah. One of them things. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Billy Goat Grow. Yeah, Billy Goat Grow. Yeah, some things. Mm. Mm. Could it be one of the spirits that roam the old hospital hallways? That's a, that's Let me know what you think. That bitch really You can watch this entire video and many more explorations of creepy abandoned buildings over on the YouTube channel, Urbex Hill. <laughs> If you see a video that you think would be perfect for the top five, or if you have a ghost hunting channel and you caught something great, in, contact me at nukes.5 at gmail.com. Like Meanwhile, your videos on TikTok. TikTok user DinoNugget741 claims that ever since he saw a quote voodoo lady in New Orleans seven years ago, oh, that something no. followed him home and that Don't the entity that shit, has not bro. left him alone ever since. Hey. He says that the mysterious spirit even follows him when he moves to a new house. He records his terrifying experiences and posts them to TikTok. One night, in an attempt to cleanse his brand new home in Colorado with Sage, the TikTok user captures something absolutely horrifying. He went to a voodoo lady. The Sage ain't even working. That's crazy. I know, It's something beating on the door. I'm not afraid, man. Come on out, man. Oh, yes. Oh, it's a clean baby, too. That's the crazy part. Whoa, 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 whoa. As he opens the door to the basement, a dark figure can be seen standing oh! in front of the staircase. Just oh! That looked like, what's his name? Uh, the nigga from Harry Potter. From Harry Potter? The nigga with the way to wear the black that look mean. And he pale. You know what I'm talking about. He is he like he like a teacher or some shit? Oh fucking Harry Potter. Yeah, that, that nigga. nigga. Oh yeah. He look like that nigga. As he opens the door to the basement, a dark figure can be seen standing at the bottom of the staircase, just kind of staring up at him. When he turns on the light, the figure disappears out of sight. He checks out the basement, but there's no one there. Then strangely, he hears the voice of what sounds like a laughing woman from upstairs, and the door slams shut. So is it real, or is this bizarre haunting just an elaborate hoax? You decide. You can check out more of his paranormal Set encounters over on his TikTok working? page and YouTube channel, Dino Nuggets 741.
it working? Oh, we ain't going nowhere. So I keep seeing comments saying that the original video is on Nuke's top fives. Uh, if somebody has the link to that, could you please send it to me? Because I, I can't seem to find it. TikTok user Dom Matigan says that his family home in Chicago was built in 1929 and that the original owner, a man named Richard Spencer, took his own life after he suffered financial ruin during the Great Depression. For years, Dom and his family have heard the strange sounds of footsteps, knocking, and even banging inside their home. The family believes that the ghost of Richard Spencer haunts the home. For One years. night around 11 p.m., Dom is home alone when suddenly the angry ghost makes a terrifying return. Dom Yo, grabs his friend. phone and Yo, starts friend. to record. Oh. So, I'm literally home alone. <laughs> Listen to how loud and aggressive Nigga. it is. Nigga! 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 That's why we're moving now. Thank you. When I say I'm never staying home, I would never take me with you. Wherever you go, wherever you go, we go together. We going out. We going to the store. Where we going? We going together. <laughs> we going together. Fucking together as a unit, a team, a that, squad. Sheesh. That nigga was beating on that bitch. That nigga made a beat. Obviously, Dom doesn't seem to be frightened at all by the incident. But Dom explained that he's heard the banging so many times now that it doesn't even really scare him anymore. Weeks later, it happens again, and Dom is ready. Okay, so we're back in the house, and every few seconds, oh. there's another. <laughs> Get the <laughs> out of here. Get the <laughs> out of here. He runs toward the door and opens it, but again, no one there. Intrigued TikTok viewers wonder what would happen if Dom started to knock back. Another night, okay. and Dom decides okay. to test it out. Okay, test the theory. Okay, so I'm just, I'm trying to get ready for bed. And there's another one. It's so Where's your family, right? Everyone's been asking me to try and knock back. <laughs> you f***. <laughs> Dom steps outside and knocks on the door himself, but the response actually comes from the closet door next to him. Okay. These days, Dom says that instead of being scared by the haunting, it has actually started to become a tiring nuisance. Dom is currently yeah. making plans to move to a new house. Plans. Is Dom's family home out. haunted by an angry ghost? You decide. You can find more of his Pick paranormal experiences over on the YouTube channel and TikTok page. Dom Matigan. So last All my resources are going to moving out that motherfucking house. I don't house. care. I don't, I don't care. give a Get damn. A new job. Moving is not hard to do. It's not. Nigga, not. pack up your assistants and, and get go. the fuck on. And go or <laughs> sell everything. Nigga, the fuck is you talking about? Nigga, I'm paying my deposit. I'm on. Nigga, apartment. Last week, I featured the story of Maddie Bark, who about? believes that a dark entity followed her home after she went on a paranormal investigation at a cemetery. Yeah, that's why we not going. That's why we ain't going. That's why we ain't doing. Oh yeah, that's one. Oh, Maggie. Oh, that's what? that one. Oh my god. That's that one. Is yeah. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Maddie says that she often sees a creepy translucent figure on the property the around her home, seemingly getting closer and closer to the house. Since the video, Maddie went on a TikTok live stream ghost investigation oh, in her own backyard in an attempt to capture the bizarre figure again. Her live stream viewers are shocked when they see something that Maddie just can't see. So these are the trees that keeps getting foggy and it's actually kind of clear well obviously you can't see the sky but it's like super clear oh the same strange pale translucent apparition Whoa. seems to appear right in that. front of maddie How she didn't see but that? what do you think you can follow maddie's paranormal experiences oh. over on her youtube channel and tiktok page maddie bark maddie needs some glasses the Red House. <laughs> Paranormal investigator Kevin Barranco from the YouTube channel Archivo Extinto oh, travels to Mexico. Guadalajara, Mexico to explore the historic. <laughs> Mexico! We're in Mexico with it! 
Yeah, why is Mexico so damn fucking haunted, bro? Uh, Mexico knows? is like super haunted. Like, I don't get it, y'all. Like, what, what y'all doing out of there? Of all the places, we've seen stuff in Japan, even south, further South America, but you know, Mexico, northern states. But Mexico, but Mexico, y'all is, like haunted, haunted. Y'all, y'all like, y'all love. like, y'all. The ghost is like, hello. How you doing? <laughs> Eat with me, brother. Eat with me, brother. <laughs> like, why y'all? Why is it so fucking haunted in Mexico? Oh, this is, this Who y'all been La Casa off? Colorada, oh. which translates to the Red House. The, red the house. house was built in 1923 and for years functioned as military barracks before becoming a hospital. The hospital was eventually closed down and the property was left empty and abandoned. Stories circulated that the remote and secluded location became a place where cults performed dark oh. rituals. Curious visitors claim to have seen witches, demons, and the skeletal female figure of Santa Muerte, a Mexican saint who is said to wear a long cloak and be the personification of death itself. Oh. Kevin is joined by his friends as they explore the creepy location, but the group be- I don't give up. I don't give up. I don't give up. I don't give up. Flying, mother. Huh? Just one this time, like it's team I don't give a damn. This motherfucker is said to be the personification of death itself. And you went looking for it. Hello. Her. You Hello. went looking for How you doing? Billy and Mandy, I challenge you to, uh, <laughs> what is it? How low can you go? <laughs> Shit, uh, good. And I think. Limbo. Mexico, oh, limbo, limbo. And I think Mexico is more scary because of the fucking names. Yeah, the yeah. The pronunciation of La fucking. Casa, da, 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 da. La Llorona. You going looking for La Llorona? Hell no. Nah. Yo, yo. yo, yo. Oh, oh. Begins to get a little nervous when they hear odd noises coming from all around them. No mames, escuchó un ruido de acá de este lado. ¿Dónde fue? ¿Dónde fue? Escuchó un ruido de este lado. Ay, cabrón, no mames. Tranquilos, tranquilos, tranquilos. Ay, no mames. Tranquilos, tranquilos. ¿Dónde fue? Aquí adentro, no sé exactamente en qué parte. The group finds strange symbols and words written on the walls inside the structure, both in Spanish and oddly in English too. And again, they hear something. Sí, esto es bastante interesante. Es una palabra en inglés que no voy a mencionar en estos momentos por cuestiones de protección hacia nosotros. Pero dentro de las palabras de dentro de esta palabra. Hay, hay un nombre muy... Acá se escucha. Sí, bien cabrón. Oh, that's a brazen. No, no, no. ¿Lo escucharon? Escuchaste. Sí, bien clarito, güey. No sé si la cámara lo captó. The camera seems to capture the sound of an unexplained deep breath coming from somewhere in the darkness. As they Death continue investigating down the your neck. the walls, they capture something downright chilling. Why you gotta say that? For all the walls, for all the walls, there are phrases. No sé, quizás unas por vandalismo, otras por sectas. La verdad es que no desconocemos el significado. La verdad es que no no queremos saber. What appears to be a cloaked figure can be seen walking oh, inside the structure, bitch. but the art. The bitch with the cloak that showed up. Oh, y'all ain't helping when a fat bitch jumped on me. Shit! She there! Look at this bitch. She right there. She walking. She chilling. She, she on an adventure. She chilling. Hi, my name is Death. <laughs> Chivo Extinto team are completely unaware of what they have just captured. So could it be Long that Kevin and his team off. captured the apparition Long of Santa Muerte, off. the cloaked lady of death? Yes! Let me know what you think down in the comments. You can yeah, watch this full scary... Y'all niggas got me bent. I ain't I'm not doing it, bro. Look, 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 look. I'm not going... I don't care how many times I might entertain the idea I ain't doing it. Because the only way I'm going to do it is if Mr. Beast put some money on it. True. That's it. You're going to have to pay me some dreams. <laughs> what are we doing for 500k, though? Nothing. 
Nothing. Rock, paper, scissors. Rock, paper. <laughs> We're keeping we need it some, clean, old fashioned. We need something scary. for 500K, y'all. Let us know, man. Mm -mm. Let us know what we need to do, man. Real way to do crew. Y'all y'all, y'all no. made it this far. Let us know what to do, man. You feel me? No. I'm never going to Mexico. You never? Never. Well, the, the, the regular parts of Mexico. We, the resort parts. We'll go to the resort parts. Now, what if the resort got goes? Shit, we just gonna have to drink together, my nigga. <laughs> 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 that didn't sound right, but anyway, that's gonna do it. We'll catch y'all in the next one. Peace, Peace out. out. My endeavor, my endeavor, my endeavor. Fire burns high. This is my endeavor, my endeavor, my endeavor. A fire burns high. I got the fire, but I ain't full. Ice, flame lit. Mama's boy so fuck